Hi everybody, this is Yuri from Sure. And Alfonso Jones from here. And today we're gonna to record Alfonso's drum kit with the Sure MV88 Plus stereo USB microphone. If you're a drummer that needs to get a high quality recording or a great sounding video of your performance with minimal setup, the MV88 Plus Stereo USB mic is a great choice. The goal of recording drums with a stereo microphone is to find a placement that gets good wide coverage of the entire drum kit, while at the same time choosing a distance that gets you the detail and tone that you want. We will show you three great starting positions. As you'll see after listening back, I chose to move my first position closer because I personally wanted to get a little more tone out of the snare drum. These subjective decisions are what makes your recordings unique, so don't hesitate to try out different distances for yourself and find what you like. Finally, once you set a good coverage position that you really enjoy, don't be afraid to reach for the EQ in the Sure Plus Motive app if, for example, you feel like you want to add a little more low end from the kick drum. Let's look at and hear a few of these starting positions, and then we can watch Alfonso jam out. Here we have position one. In this position, I have the MV88 Plus looking over the entire drum kit in a very, very similar fashion that you would get in a studio when you have two overhead microphones. This is a stereo microphone, and right now I have it set up to be in audience perspective, but if you want to switch it to drummer's perspective, you can use the left-right swap switch on the Motive app. Right now, this microphone is looking down at the snare drum, but is wide enough in the stereo field to cover the entire drum kit. Let's give it a listen. And now we have position two. This microphone is now facing the front of the drum kit, still pointing roughly at where the snare drum would be, but because of its position, it's actually gonna get a little bit more definition out of the kick drum. This is ideal for uh, styles of music that are dance focused or something that's a little bit more kick drum driven. Let's give it a listen. And this is position three, which is very, very similar to what we just had in position one, but this one is looking over the drummer's shoulder. Like the first position, it's still pointing at the snare drum, but still covering the full range of the kit. But the idea here is that you're a little bit closer to what the drummer is hearing and a little bit more real to the drummer's perspective.